actually, and also we are very close. Also, we have uh, worked for two months, maybe two months. Yeah, we also have discussed about some future collaboration and also discussed with them. Also, this is very yeah attractive and also great opportunity for us. Yeah. Also, I want to uh, mention in details in this uh, space. Then second, it's, uh, yeah, it's uh, main, main purpose of this uh, space. So uh, 2024 roadmap. Yeah, I actually, we mostly focus on data valuation, right? Yeah, also data is, uh, yeah, values, values. Also, we mostly focus on IoT. It's our, uh, yeah, our also our roadmap and also like, uh, yeah, yeah, future vision in this industry. It's really great opportunity for using uh, IoT data, IoT data combine uh, personal information and also to provide some next innovation company or like a data monetizing and also to protect security and share it, right? So that's why, yeah, it's really good opportunity for this uh, meeting space. So, I want to use some slide. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, for this 2024 roadmaps, uh, I want to explain about that. The first one is data valuations. And also this is special focus on increasing type and volume of data. We have the, the, about this section, there are two tasks. The first one, task one is IoT device collaborations. Also, this is our big plan to create in, in time of creating this uh, document, but already announcement. It, uh, maybe you guys guess which product is collaborating with Japanese. And also I, I checked the uh, Samsung and uh, Intel maybe, but yeah, Panasonic, it's uh, yeah, maybe yeah, great surprise for them. Also, yeah, for me also. also. So yeah, yeah, it's really yeah, good partnership with Panasonic IoT device company. They have very good uh, devices. Also, most all devices are connect through Wi-Fi, and also they have some uh, behavior or some activity through IoT devices. But they don't manage it because the, all of the data doesn't connect uh, personal information. So that's why yeah, it's really a great opportunity for providing personal data locker to customize IoT device models in Panasonic. Yeah, and also this is very good IoT collaboration models. The, yeah, and also development new function with the company, this Panasonic, and also the demonstration of IoT data utilization. This is also Q3 and Q4, uh, our roadmaps. Yeah, task two is AI customize. Yeah, also, yeah, we focus on task one, IoT device collaborations. So as I posted in X, the roadmap for 2024 is based on the white paper concept. Yeah, I actually, I wrote this white paper in 2020, uh, four, years, four years ago. Also, and we want to make it the year we start implementing two major things. The first one is data variation. So we will focus on increasing the type and amount of data that can be identified as my data, right? It's very important. It's my data from this computer, right? So we have been able to identify blockchain PCs, users behavior, yeah, et cetera. But it was still insufficient considering the scope of the person's activities. So this year we will focus on IoT devices, that's why. And task one, so we will collaborate with Panasonic Advanced Technology. Actually it was still undecided when the plan was formulated. 
So, but we were able to make an announcement during March. Yeah, this is very yeah good surprising. Also, already start discuss with how to create some platform. Yeah, and also yeah Panasonic's part is a software developing companies in the mobility field. Yeah, from individual robots such as automated driven driving and uh, construction equipment to logistics systems. Yeah, there are whole models. So a lot of IoT devices. And also we will expand our platform cap uh, capabilities to accurately input data coming in from the devices and use it for AI training and other applications while protecting privacy is very important. So the scope of partnership is quite deep. So we will also focus on creating specific MVP models. So task two is more focused on AI customized. So additional AI specifications for personal data lockers and expanded uh, blockchain PC functionality for AIs. So this is why so we want more focus on AI. So now customize existing product featuring features, fe features for AI training to be deployed in yeah, this junction, uh, AI focus layer too. I already, already uh, announcement. So currently, yeah, yeah, for example, open AI products are difficult to prove how the answers were generated. So this is because the input data is mainly from the internet and lacks accuracy, right? So we would like to provide a distributed data library for accurate data input from two perspectives. So first one is past PDF, personal data locker, are uh, the database associated with the owner itself from which data feed to AI training can be traced is very important, I think. So next is blockchain PC. So which will have the ability to label the logo information generated by the device and extracts only the information needed for input. So this is our yeah, data variation models. It's very we mostly focus on IoT and AI in these years. Yeah, the se second one, so for tokenomics, token economics. So this is incorporation of Jasmine token into the platform, right? Yeah, you know where. Jasmine create IoT platform by the basement function is hyperledger fabric. It's consortium of chain, right? There are only few nodes. It's like a private chain, but more confidence about uh, security transactions and like a KYC function. So that's why we can uh, share the data in safe, safely to others. Yeah, and also the, about tokenomics, we have two tasks. The first one is just me wallet implementations. So yeah, this is also yeah, really important to utilize tokens in, in on the on the platform. So yeah, there are four functions. So point system in and exchange collaboration X system models and. Uh, token and value exchanges within wallet models. Yeah, from this means from token to uh, from point to token. The last one, feature activation with tokens in wallet. Like uh, this is like a upgrade models, like a fun function functions, as upgrade function. Yeah, so yeah, I think so. First is data validation, then second tokenomics, deploy JASME token on the platform. Also the wallet will allow users to transfer crypto assets and stable coins among themselves, as well as to award points. Yeah, both function on JASME layer one, this is JASME's platform, and blockchain, blockchain transaction takes. Yeah, include our point is also on chain. 
the test model has already been completed and will be moved to a demonstration with users. Yeah, plans include earning points tied to user behavior, seamless exchange of points and tokens, and upgrade the wallet function with tokens, right? This is our JASME wallet implementation. Yeah, in a joint project with the client, a mechanism linking the wallet and the exchange is also being con considered, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is a great opportunity for collaborating with good company for issuing stable coin. And also, yeah, also some of the uh, projects want to collaborate with uh, these sections, uh, like uh, uh, issuing token, issuing stable coin, and using wallet function. Yeah, and also task two is lockup. Yeah, the, yeah, the first step was to implement a token lockup in cooperation with an exchanges. Yeah, this is because the fact that a license is required to hold customers' assets when doing business in Japan and from a security point of view. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so uh, for example, FTX, so it, especially only in Japan, the, the uh, user assets are protected in regulation in Japan. So that's why this is a secure, security point of view uh, for collaboration with our exchanges. So Jasmine, Jasmine Coin was deposited into the offshore account of the exchange and lockup. So using the amount as a source of funding, issue the same number of Jasmine coin on Jasmine layer one. This is Jasmine's platform, all right? So now ready, uh, 100 million Jasmine coins are ready stored within the exchange for this ecosystem. So, and this will be used to finance the insurance of Jasmine coin on the chain. So the number of Jasmine will be granted according to user's action or behavior and will increase as the ecosystem is formed. Yeah, so this is also tokenomics model using wallet implementation and lockup function for moves to Jasmine's platform from like a exchange it in market into Jasmine's platform by using lockup function. Also, if this is also first step. The second one is for the feature activation with tokens. It is in wallet functions. This is also second lockup. So uh, getting some additional function or upgrade services, for example, getting new opportunity or get, getting uh, more reward for providing data, right? So this is our lockup function we are planning. Also, the third one, this is, yeah, yeah, something new project. So carbon credit exchanges, already announcement. So, but yeah, start of exchange business. Yeah, exchange means not only uh, cryptocurrency exchanges, not meaning, not the meaning of cryptocurrency, but also this is carbon credit exchanges. So yeah, compliant with Japanese regulations, we start to, uh, yeah, start of exchange business. So we have four tasks. The first one is de development of Jasmine carbon credit exchanges. This is this name is temporary, but yeah, there are some. Uh, as for carbon credit, we have yeah, being done for from uh, two perspectives. We are working on this from uh, to create our own platform and to provide the infrastructure for other projects. We have two perspectives. So both of these projects are in collaboration with local government. Yeah, because in regulation, because of the regulations and also, yeah, create something new project with government. Also, the, yeah, about task one. So the equip, equipped with some base exchange functions and also credit offset functionality with token bonds. 
this is uh, uh, so task one. Yeah, so about carbon credit. Yeah, we, we want to uh, be some, we will build, build a marketplace that utilizes NFT functions using ERC uh, 1155, 1155, I'm sure, 1155. And we have the ability to transfer and burn a large number of tokens at once. Right, this is uh, ERC 1155 functions. The reason for an NFT is that we are aware that in the future, the credit will be attached to products and belong to individual users. So we believe that the credit will raise the environment awareness of individual users, which is also a data value, right? It's very important to consider about the environment. Also task two, so regulations, so voluntary market application of the same standard and J credit certification. Also, I'm embarrassed, so like this, it's happened to a typo. And also, yeah, sorry for this typo. So we are preparing to establish a standard as a voluntary market and to acquire J credit standard. Yeah, it's very simple. So the task one, task three launch is also simple. We will open a uh, testament and limited access. So by uh, this year's Q4. The task four, task four, the final one. So product collaboration and also create linkage uh, through blockchain PCs. This means, yeah, we are uh, experimenting with using blockchain PC to reduce CO2 emissions, Spe uh, specifically uh, the reduction of gasoline consumption will reduce CO2 emissions if operations can be uh, managed even work even when working remotely. So yeah, it's very simple. If you don't use car, so it's to go to uh, office, so you can reduce CO2. Right, so that's why if we can, this is, uh, yeah, although, although also we are doing this uh, new project, also uh, involved some local company, local government, and so on, especially our R&D starting uh, Kyushu region, the west side of Japan. Yeah, so that's why this is very good environment for creating something new and co cooperation with some local government and some local companies and so on. Yeah, that's all. Thank you so much for uh, listening my explanations. Uh, actually, I, if, you have, if you guys have any questions, I have a few minutes for asking you guys. How to okay please raise your hand okay mr uh, yes yes i for joining good morning i am in the u.s west palm beach florida so i wow. i just want to i just want to you know thank you for the time you take to to talk about the the project and what you guys are doing uh, are amazing and um i've been holding jasmine for, for about 18 months now so it's been it's been great now my question for you is this so you're talking about the 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 lockup i know you're gonna you're gonna start with 100 millions now you have the partnership the partnership with panasonic when you have a partnership does that mean that company will also will have to lack to lack of some some jasmine in order to use to use the platform like how does the lack of work when you have a partnership does that mean more lack of will 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 come up uh yeah thank you so much for your uh, questions uh, it's a very good questions uh yeah actually i don't 
talk about all of the collaboration models with Panasonic, only to start the line in this in this time. Yeah, yeah, uh, maybe last yesterday, yesterday. Yeah, uh, that's why I set the meeting uh, this space this time. Uh, yeah, already decided to announce this for yeah from uh, with uh, Panasonic yesterday. So that's why. Yeah, it's really. Um, yeah, there are some options to collaborate with. You know, some create some like a uh, yeah, uh, yeah IoT platform, especially IoT platform. At first, it convert to uh, more focus on IoT devices. Also, they have the data, IoT device and like a behavior and some activity from the data devices, and we provide the personal data local function. Also, this is uh, the person, it, it uh, needs to convert to uh, IoT models, more focus on IoT models. Also, we spent three, three around three months for this developing. So at first we create, uh, well, co-develop co IoT platforms for combining IoT data and personal data, right? This is first, first model. Then there are some possibility to expanding other business. Also, this Panasonic has big vision, right? Also, including using like uh, other token functions or uh, co they are concerning about other chains, right? So this means uh, uh, like uh, interoperability or uh, more focus on open source blockchain and and so on. Uh, they have some options or. Uh, yeah, great big visions through these partnerships, right? So that's why I don't mention, I, I cannot mention about uh, Panasonic holds token or not. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe this is our- No, I mean, I was not, I, I, I was not asking you to say how much they have, no, nothing okay. like that. I, I, I just wanna know if I have a partnership with you, does that mean I'm gonna have to 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 get some like a, a certain amount of jasmine that will be out of the circulating supply? That's that's the only thing I wanna know. Not that for you to mention how much or no, nothing like okay. that. I just wanna know if they're gonna have a certain amount that will be out that 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 will that, that won't be part of the circulating supply. Yeah, sure. Also, we don't uh, move or change some circulating supply until now, uh, only to store exchanges and uh, keep, uh, keep mm, or store, store the token and don't touch it. This is a uh, lockup, that's all. Also the circulating supply checks the, uh, uh, only the Jasmine's deployer contact, right? Address, deployer address. So this is only uh, un lock, lock up amount. Also, we don't touch it. So for using these functions, that's why. Uh, yeah, maybe market. Uh, yeah, in market users uh, cannot easily understand what what amount is uh, actually. Uh, locked up in the market you know, by just me incorporated. Uh, so yeah, actually we want to create our layer ones, um, like a scan, scan, scans, like anal analyzers, like a ESA scan and so on. Yeah, so this is also our, uh, how many tokens we should issue on chain or uh, yeah, so that's why maybe there are, uh, you, you cannot, you guys uh, cannot easily check the, how, ma how many tokens is locked up only in oh. exchanges in Japan. All right, thank you so much. You're welcome. Yeah, for me, me Maya, Maya Pictures, 
Hi there, Hara. Hope you are well. You have a huge following from all over the world. And uh, we do Twitter spaces. Um, uh, I have a follow-up question from the last question. Is there a limit on how much can be locked up? Um, and is that limit around 36 billion? And also, can you explain the importance of J Credit and what they do? Um, this is for the J Credit certification part of the uh, credit exchange. Just for the yeah, sure. international community, so they have an understanding of what they focus on and why it is so important. Yeah, exactly. Okay, thank you so much. And also about token lockup, uh, we don't set some limit. Also, I want to start a 100 million amount for to convert Jasmine token. For this is for providing users for the uh, like a reward function or. Uh, yeah, uh, this is the first step of data monetize, right? So this is our, uh, also uh, providing uh, wallet function is included. Uh, yeah, we are discussing about uh, how to use the tokens on chain. So, oh, so that's why on, only to set the first amount, then want to add the uh, amount for lockup and Next, providing other functions like uh, yeah. Now we are discussing some uh, project for utilizing data. Utilizing means users should own data and also provide it to some project for next marketing, digital marketing, or customer relationships management, and so on. So yeah, user can provide the data and get some reward. The reward is just me coins. So this is our yeah simple and also very important ecosystem in Jasmine coins, right? That, so that's why we uh, mostly focus on the set the budget in this uh, quarter round. Then uh, add the amount for yeah while the progress of this ecosystem creating the ecosystem. And also the second one is J Credit. J Credit is a Japanese standard models of carbon credit. Also, not only tokens or uh, yeah, blockchain tokens on blockchain, but also this is very uh, blockchain is very suit for this industry because yeah, where is the carbon coming from? And for so this is uh, yeah very important. And also yeah, from the devices by sensor like a sensor. So it can be easy to get some information. We, we, we can provide the device management function, right? Also, the J credit needs the carbon offset. Carbon offset means, uh, yeah, so I, for example, I'm a, I'm a company side. So I spend some uh, electronics, uh, so I spend some CO2. So that's why I have to buy carbon credit. So yeah, I, I, I buy some yeah, credit through these exchanges. So I get some uh, yeah, carbon credit tokens. So I have to offset these tokens by using burn functions, token burn functions, right? So we can, after burning the tokens, uh, I can get the certificate of the burning. This is because uh, for submitting the government, right? So I spend, uh, I, I buy and burn this credit for, yeah, one, uh, 1,000 kilograms, for example. So this is our duty for this industry. This, and also this certificate, it's suit for J credit or not. It's very important because in this uh, Japanese regulation, so that's why, yeah, not only J credit, only not only J credit, but it's at first step, so it's suit for J credit. And the other one, there are some voluntary market. They don't have J, J credit standard, but it's only also available for like a in, yeah same situations, right? So that's why. We have two per, two visions of this carbon credit exchanges. Also, also getting some license yeah, for yeah standard in J credit, and 
the in maybe common allowance from this voluntary market. This is the same, right? Yeah. So is it clear? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much for your comprehension. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. So Mr. D. Mr. D. So sorry. So you your Mr. D. Your turn. Okay, so another one. So, Mr. Ne Ne Neb Nebin Nebin Nabi, can you hear me? Hi, Arasen. Uh, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Thank yeah, you for yes, joining. I like, yeah, I would like to ask uh, any news about uh, innovation zone, uh, just make any innovation zone in the Binance. Yeah, actually, this is very important for us. Also, we are getting contacts with Binance and uh, through some uh, purposes. For example, uh, in Denver, I met some Binance guys also. Yeah. Uh, also, we have al already have some uh, listing or marketing uh, communities, communities, and person in charge of the yeah, person. Uh, yeah, just me in charge. Also, yeah, I but and also we create newly the uh, Telegram communities. This is also important, and yeah, but I don't have enough answers uh, for how, how to remove the uh, innovation zone. But we, yeah, we still yeah, keep going, also collaborating with good company, good product, and also create new token ecosystems, right? So that's why, yeah, I, I have to do my best for this, yeah, big, yeah, big issues. Uh, so yeah, keep in touch with Binance and also yeah, yeah, that yeah that's all. And also yeah, this is very good situation. I think the market by market cap is yeah quite good, over one billion. This is one one of the uh, my goals to achieve one billion. This is unicorn. Only yeah, just me. Doesn't have any enough like a uh, achievement such a big companies also, but in in evaluation of market it's quite good, I think. So that's why it's my my and also our board members confidence. So yeah, so that's why we still uh, create some new platform and create some product and create some new token economies. By two purposes, two purposes, and in yeah, wallet and local functions are moving into Jasmine's ecosystem, and the junctions that create a new token ecosystems through AI training or AI computing models, right? So that's why this is very uh, yeah important to discuss with Binance, uh, uh, yeah, in continuous. So yeah, sorry for I don't have a uh, yeah clear clear answer like that. But yeah, we still doing and also yeah keep more. Yeah, thank thanks you so for your explanation. Yeah, thank you so much for your explanation. Thanks. Yeah. Okay. So next is last one. So Mr. Deep, can you hear me? Uh yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah. How are okay. You? I'm good. How are you? I'm waiting to come back to Japan. So Wow. Uh, yeah, great. It's really a uh, cherry blossom season, right? I know, I know. I need Jasmine's Very price beautiful. to do. I need yeah, Jasmine's yeah, price yeah. to go higher. I need yeah, Jasmine's yeah. price to go higher, then I can come to Japan. But yeah, um sure. okay, so I just wanted to clarify something. Um do 
companies need to purchase Jasmine coin in order to participate on the carbon credit platform? Uh, yeah, actually, this is not. But for okay. lockup, lock, lock I plan to do that. Oh, not only carbon credit. Not but only, not on carbon no, credit or no, not no. only carbon? No, no, no. Sorry, sorry. Uh, we don't plan to use uh, tokens, just me coins on carbon credit until now. Only to use uh, J credit or uh, voluntary J market credit. standard by using okay. NFT function, ERC 1155. Okay. okay. And then um, will Jasmine coin be burned in the future or will only? or will it only be carbon credits on the carbon credit platform that are burned? Because this was on the roadmap that there would be a token burn under the carbon credit pl um, platform, but I want to confirm if or not Jasmine uh, will also be burned in different use cases. Uh, yeah, actually, uh, in, in our white paper, we don't use the token burns. We don't, we okay. don't run it. Yeah, only to uh lock up is so a remove in uh marketplace marketplace is on exchanges to convert right. for yeah for the purpose ecosystem okay okay and last question so with the uh with the panasonic partnership and the the platform you're going to build for them how many users do you guys expect to get out of that how many user user means uh, like PD, uh, or, personal data lockers? PD, data PD, lockers. Data, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, in honest, there are one million, one hundred million or more devices they have. So, yeah, this is also a great opportunity for such a big, huge amount of data. And yeah, we mostly focus on. 100k users in this time in this year maybe early early this year right so th this is our, our one of the goals uh, 100k for joining yeah uh, especially in pdf okay cool thank uh, you yeah thank you so much yes yeah. if you come here so let's discuss about some good good future just me just meet future or like uh yeah some ex expect from a market that sounds good i'm looking for a new job so oh wow yeah i don't i don't want to work in finance in america anymore so but uh right. yeah thank you for answering my questions harasan yeah sure thank you so much yeah Thank you so much for all of guys in attending this space. Yeah. Also, uh, like KJ is a new community manager. Also, uh, can answer about the questions. Also, yeah. Let uh, you, if you have any questions or uh, expect about the project, yeah. Please don't hesitate to ask me or kj in telegram and also like a uh, uh twitter and so on so yeah community manager work uh, is, uh have some responsibility of this uh, part i think so that's why we want to keep discussion with the community guys also to grow uh, grow up and also going to go to next stage for over 50s right so that's why, right. yeah, thank you so much for today's space meeting. And also please keep in touch. Yeah, have a nice day. Bye.